The Forty Rules of Lao is a novel that explores the theme of love through the lens of Sufism, a mystical Islamic belief system. The story centers around Ella Rubinstein, a middle-aged Jewish woman who is unhappily married and unfulfilled in her life. She finds solace in the teachings of the 13th century Sufi poet Rumi, and begins to learn more about his life and teachings. Along the way, she discovers the story of Shams of Tabriz, Rumi's spiritual mentor, and their intense friendship. Through Ella's journey, the novel explores the various forms of love and the impact it can have on one's life. Ella is a translator, and is assigned to translate a book of Rumi's poetry. As she delves deeper into Rumi's teachings, she begins to find a sense of purpose and meaning in her life. She starts to see the beauty and power of love in everything around her and starts to question her own unhappy life. The more she learns about Rumi and Shams, the more she begins to realize that love can take many forms, including the love between a spiritual teacher and student. Ella discovers that Rumi and Shams had a deep and transformative friendship, which was rooted in love and spiritual understanding. Shams, who was a wandering dervish, arrived in Rumi's life and changed it forever. He showed Rumi the true nature of love and helped him to transcend the boundaries of his own ego and discover the divine within himself. Their friendship was intense and passionate, and it helped Rumi to become one of the greatest poets and spiritual figures in history. As Ella delves deeper into the story of Rumi and Shams, she begins to see parallels between their friendship and her own life. She starts to question the nature of her own relationships and starts to realize that true love requires sacrifice, selflessness, and a willingness to let go of one's own ego. She begins to see that true love is not just about finding happiness, but about becoming a better person and transcending one's own limitations. The novel also explores the theme of self-discovery, as Ella begins to question her own beliefs and values. She starts to see that her unhappiness is rooted in her own lack of self-awareness and her inability to see the beauty and wonder of the world around her. She starts to realize that true happiness comes from within, and that it is not something that can be found in external circumstances. Through Ella's journey, the novel also explores the idea that love is not just a feeling, but a state of being. Love is not something that can be grasped or possessed, but something that is always present and available to us. The novel suggests that love is a force that can transform our lives and help us to see the world in a new and different way. The Forty Rules of Love is a novel that explores the many facets of love, from the passionate and intense love between Rumi and Shams, to the quiet and subtle love that can be found in everyday life. It is a novel that reminds us that love is the most powerful force in the universe, and that it has the power to change our lives forever. It is a novel that encourages us to look beyond our own limitations and to see the beauty and wonder of the world around us. It is a novel that will resonate with readers of all ages and backgrounds, and will leave them with a sense of hope and inspiration.